Link 2012. I want to get a good setup here. So first things first, that means that we gotta scratch this bow. This bow is pretty bad when it comes to what, we're, what we need. We need a punch bow. Yes, we need a we need a comeback spell right here. Now, unfortunately, I need to repair this, and I don't know if I can. Yeah, I can't repair it. So we're gonna need a new bow. Comeback's bow has power four, right? The reason I want comeback's bow with power is because it has punch. And we sort of need punch a lot of it because we want to throw the, the boss away. All right. There we go. Now our pickaxe, I don't know if I should take it. I'm going to take it initially, but if this boss fights hard, we're going to ditch him. Oh, that was scary. There, there's a, a lawnmower outside or a weed whacker going on outside. Okay. Now, our armor is the biggest issue here. We really want a lot of protection. Uh, reason being is that we... I have protection for... Oh, this has no protection. Beacon of Hope. Perfect. Oh, holy moly, that's trippy. We're super fast now. This is a lot of protection. This boss has, I think he's got high thorns. He's got, oh, so resistance 2 wouldn't be bad. He's got, uh, ex and I think he has explosion and fire attacks. So we need blast protection. Let's see if we have any unbreakable... I think we might have unbreakable ivory. I doubt we have unbreakable. Yeah, we do have an unbreakable ivory chest plate. So we can make this boss fight last forever, really. <gasps> Oh, boy. So this is two extra hearts. This is also two extra hearts, but this is faster. I'm going to use a mithril chest plate here. We're going to put blast protection on this guy. And that's Paladin, right? Oh, the whole Paladin set is unbreakable. Why aren't these sets unbreakable? I mean, like, if I'm willing to give you plus 2 XP per kill, why not? Oh, whatever. I don't know. This game's weird. We're not going to go for a full Mithril set, though. We are going to replace the pants, though, I think. The boots, I really, really like Angelic Feet. Right, armor, Blast Protection. Where's my Blast Protection? And fire protection and blast protection. Fire protection. Oh, please tell me I have some blast. Yeah, we do. I'm pretty sure that doesn't break the set, which is nice. And we need some legs. I don't think that we have any unbreakable diamond legs. That are interesting. Joyous leggings look pretty cool. So we're probably going to just use Paladin legs in the end. I know, this is so weird. We're like taking different parts of different sets to use as a... To use as our armor. Because I don't want to break. I don't want to bring multiple pairs of armor. I want to beat this boss and be done with him. Um, thankfully... Oh, we need infinity on this. That way it's going to last us through the whole boss fight. Oh, that's going to cost us though. Let's put fire protection on you. 
Let's get infinity on this bow. We have the bottles. How much was it? 15 levels, right? Yes, we need 15. 15. Boom. Right now we have our bow set up. We have our our sword will last us, I'm thinking. I'm not sure if I want to use a sword like hope. Because that will remove our effects in the end. We're going to need a lot of food because we're just going to be taking damage and not doing a lot of killing. We do have our panic potion, which is nice. Um, Block-wise, we're pretty set. I'm pretty sure we can kill this guy with just our bow. So let's just hope that's the case. Now, our other issue is potions. We're going to want some potions. I'm going to bring a, a strength potion. Where's the strength potion? Here we go. Oh, these are Berserker potions. Strength slash speed. All right, well, let's take a strength splash potion. We'll take a speed potion, but just one, because I don't think we need to be very speedy for this boss fight. Now, we need regen. This is going to be our main issue, is regen. No. I like the regeneration that uh, the beastly potion gives. And it's not bad because we do have the what is it? We don't have wither. Wait, what gives us? Is there anything that gives us wither too? You see, I remember that there was something that gave us wither too that we could use to remove the effects of this. Poison 2, antidotes. Holy water will do the trick. Yeah, I don't remember. But I think we're going to use a beastly potion. But we're also going to bring a lot of instant health. A lot of instant health. Right, we're set. I think we'll be able to beat the boss with this. I know that he gives you effects when he's close to you. So I don't know if that's going to be a plus or a minus. Right. I am sort of excited, though. Right. This is going to use up our hunger like mad, though. We really should get an extended cheesy potion. Caps lock. Um, there we go. We're right here. I don't remember what this boss is called. I want to get his name. I, I, cause this boss is pretty cool. Um, the entire volcano in here was lava originally. So I had to remove a bunch of layers and actually made this whole part myself. Sounds like he's already in there. Let's hope this is good guys. All right, we have everything we need. Only thing we could really get more is fire uh, resistance, but that's okay. All right, so we go through here. We really should have jumped in, but here we go. So here's the boss fight. I can't remember. Do we need to go to the middle? Oh boy. Nope, 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 nope. Oh, their heads aren't working properly. That's strange. But they're. Yeah. All right, let's drink this. Oh, I'm getting some effect in here. Get out of here. 
All right. Wonderful. All right. We have our regen three on now, so we shouldn't have too much of a problem. We are getting lots of lag, though. As you can see, lots and lots of lag, which is quite annoying. He shoots these guys out. These guys will explode when they get to you, I'm pretty sure. Or they give you some effect. Either way, you don't want to touch them. This boss fight was, I think, made with melee in mind. The only issue, of course, is it's difficult to actually get in there and hit him without taking a lot of damage. Alright, well, let's go get his name, though. What was that? Ouch, 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 ouch. Nether Slime Queen. Oh, okay. So this is a throwback to uh, Herobrine's, what is it? Uh, return. Or Herobrine's, sorry, Herobrine's, yeah, Herobrine's Return. So in Herobrine's Return, there is a magma cube called uh, Magma Queen, Magma Queen Slime, whatever this guy's called. And, ouch, ouch, ouch. Okay, so these guys are actually attacking me. Okay. Uh, and you had to d do a quest by defeating her in order to get some cool stuff. It was a side quest. There were a lot of side quests in uh, the Herobrine series. That was really fun. As you can see, these lava pillars come up, so they act as an obstacle for your play. These things are fireballs, but you can't, or or something along those lines. Like they, they might be little fire enemies, but of course you can't tell because the head's messed up for some reason. This, I had to do, I, I believe I, I can't remember what theme I got the 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 background of this area from but I do know I took it from somewhere and I, I, I copied the general idea of it so you see we have the the veins of uh, obsidian we have the different types of stone and all, of course all the lava coming down the as you can see we have jump boost in here this is to make the fight more exciting. So really, you have... Oh, yeah, you can jump around. Do all your stuff. He... Magma Queen might be in invincible at a distance. Because it doesn't seem like she's taking any damage here. And everything in here should be of a light level to where stuff doesn't spawn, but obviously you saw right there. It's not always going to be the case. is way less fun when it's it's lagging oh boy okay get out of here don't get out of here come back down my McQueen come back down I believe I have it set up to where she's supposed to track you, but apparently not. Come here. Oh, there we go. She's back. I do know I have it set up to where if she escapes, um, which she does at times, <laughs> she teleports back in here. That was one of the big problems I had to fix was the Magma Queen would just keep going out. The other big problem was that she would keep regenerating whenever... Uh, players left the area, so I had to leave that warning of, hey, there's a lot of health, she regenerates. Um, oh, snap, one second. <laughs> 